back so I'm not so close. Hello! What's up? Cheers! <laughs> Start our class. Cheers, darling. Yeah. Happy Monday. Hello, everyone. <laughs> We're not drunk. We're actually drinking water with oils in it, of course. Yes. Yes. <laughs> um, welcome to our, our little live class on clean home. Who is this? Shelby. Hi. Um, we are about to just share with you guys really the importance of, you know, it's spring clean time. Yeah. And, you know, we're, everyone's starting to, you know, there's been a lot of Marie Kondo going on, a lot of, like, organizing, a lot of, like, getting rid of clutter and all of that stuff. And, you know, we, with, you know, as Young Living, oily life people are, have this amazing opportunity to clean our homes in a t way that's toxin-free. And for a lot of us, that's one of the main reasons, you know, we live this oily life is to really get rid of the toxins in our homes. So today we're gonna to talk to you guys about how to do that using your Young Living products. We're so excited. And it's so easy. The good thing about the uh, Young Living is that it makes it easier. It's a one-stop shop instead of having to look piecemeal it all together and ah! Yes, and you can. Tr and it's, yeah. it's a company we can trust, right? We know that with their oils, with their seed to seal promise. So yeah, so we're gonna just dive in to um to that in a moment but yeah please oh. share that this is this is you know just looking at what the reality is around chemicals in our current society and in our cleaning products um and the products we use on our bodies it's just a good refresher to kind of take stock of, of what These we're being numbers. exposed to all the time and um Bummer was going to share the numbers yeah, not all the numbers because they're kind of all it's scary <laughs> and a little overwhelming. Just to give an idea, yeah. roughly 13,000 chemicals are used in cosmetics alone, mm -hmm. of which only 10% have been evaluated for safety, and new ones are introduced every year. Oh my gosh, terrifying. So you have to be, that's like, I think the answer to every one of these stats is you have to be an informed consumer. Yes. Um, so ordinary household products can be a major source of chemical exposure that add to your body's toxic load. Um, exposure to industrial chemicals and pollutants, obviously you walk outside the door, mm -hmm. you get hit with stuff, you can't really, that's, you can't. Unless you're wearing some, like an air mask. And and even then helmet. I think, I, yeah. I, yeah. I, like a space mask, exactly, like a moon like a mask. Suit. Like maybe if we all get like the moon man space suit. You know, like, exactly. But we mean, have, we, you have to control what you control. You gotta exactly, realize what exactly. you can't control. Exactly. I think that leads to sanity. Yes. Um, so wow, children are enter, entering puberty at younger and younger ages. In 2010, the average age of onset puberty was 10.5 years old for girls. Mm. Yeah. Six years younger than in 1860 when it was 16 and a half oh years gosh. old. So something's happening. I'm yes. just going to scroll down to read off a couple of other numbers, but I think you know where we're going. So yeah. this is chemical exposures that begin, they, we all get exposed to these chemicals when we're babies in the womb. Yeah, in it vitro. starts that early, through the mother into the womb. Everything is... Hey, Everything an expected mother takes into her body can potentially get passed along to her developing child. And in 2005, a landmark study found an average of 200 industrial chemicals and pollutants in the umbilical cord of blood of infants born in the United States. It didn't say the UK. It didn't say the EU. No. It's born in the United States. Where they have, they have way stricter regulations in the UK. Yeah, they, they, we actually have products that are made differently for America and everybody else. Mm -hmm. And the ones in America are allowed to have known toxins in it. It's like free um, for all yeah. chemicals. And like, okay, of the 287 chemicals detected in the umbilical cord blood, we know that 180 cause cancer in humans or animals. Yeah. 217 are toxic to the brain and nervous system and 208 cause birth defects or abnormal developmental development in animal tests. I'm done with numbers. These numbers are sad. Ooh, let's just It's just information. That. We're just going to take that it's in. It's just information. Yeah, but it, it, information, you know, at its, at its best, yeah, it yeah. empowers us, right, yeah. to make decisions that align with who we want to be and what we, the world we want to create. So... I think those are important. Even I think it's harsh. important. They're they're harsh, but because we, yeah. we want to believe in our government and yeah. and uh, you just have to you have we have to be our own advocates now. 
Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And her thieves. Yes. This, so, is, this is where it gets easier. Yes. <laughs> so part of being our own advocates, right, is obviously doing our own research and and finding um, what what is best for us and what you know how getting the stuff out that we that isn't good for us, right? So a lot of you guys, you know, you already have your starter kit, so you've taken a huge step into detoxing your life as it is. You're yeah. using these oils, which is amazing. And one of the oils in that starter kit is the most famous, which would be named? Thieves. <laughs> Thieves. <laughs> I was like, wait a second, it's right there. Yes. Thieves. <laughs> so Thieves, tell, me, tell us about the story of Thieves. It smells so good, it but does. that's it not the story. Like, it smells like Christmas in it, a bottle. It does, it's like Christmas in a bottle, or like fall and winter, cozy time. Well, the fun story, and as I, I noticed, I put a little bit of my <laughs> doggy's hey, hair on there. That's all great. Um, is mm -hmm. during the Black Plague, uh, grave robbers of the people who passed uh, from the plague, they would go into the graves and steal the gold from the people who had perished from the Black Plague. Mm -hmm. And folklore states that those thieves showed no signs of the plague. They did not get the plague from the deceased uh, who they robbed. Yeah. Um, and uh, the cops, had said, hey, we're gonna be more lenient with you if you tell us how you did that. <laughs> so this the is my version of the time. <laughs> the popo -po of the time. The popo -po. -po of the time has said, what they had said was. <laughs> so just, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. they were like, we'll go easier if you, how are, how come, how don't you have the plague? Yes. And what they made themselves, it was called a vinegar back then, was uh, a vinegar made out of botanicals. Mm. And Gary Young, the, the founder of Young Living created this from that vinegar that's, that stems all the way back wow. to that history. I love that. And this is the first year that I've listened to everybody. I mean, you have to hear the information a couple of times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I use this every single day, mm. every single day starting from November mm. when everybody was like, <coughs> I was like, I'm going to start to do what they said to do. Yes. Keep yourself above the wellness line. Don't wait till you're below it. Yep. And I did not have any kind of any immune system problems this uh, wow. from uh, Thanksgiving, from Christmas, from wow. everybody was so not so good this year. So many people. And I rubbed it on my back, I rubbed it on my feet, I made some tea with it, Amazing. and everyday thieves. Uh, every day. Love it. Love it. Good job. Oh, thank you. I love that. Oh. So, so also, you guys, one thing I'll say as to what, you know, as we merge into talking about the, the household cleaning products is that Thieves has been tested literally next to bleach as far as getting rid of bacteria, and it gets rid of just as much bacteria. You guys can Google this stuff. It's out there. You can find it. You can, you can, exactly, you can put it, you can ingest it, and it's stronger than bleach. Bleach don't ingest. Thieves you can ingest. Bleach do right? not ingest. <laughs> so we're just used to thinking of these chemical things as clean, right? Bleach, 409, Lysol, all of these, these things are like, oh, I'm, I'm cleaning my house. But really what we're doing is, is chemicalizing, tox, toxifying our homes and passing it as clean because it smells the way we were taught clean smells. Or, you know, we don't see the dirt anymore. However, what we're actually doing is spreading these chemicals all over our floors, um, you know, on our toilet seat, in our bath, and then we are, you know, sitting in the bath water that's been bleached, all, you know, the whole tub's been bleached, and you're sitting in hot bath water soaking that up. You're walking, you know, we're walking on the floors in our bare feet. Our dogs are, our kids are, mm -hmm. eating food off the floor, right, that, yeah. that has been completely, to to you know, toxic filled right and then we're Toxified. wondering Toxified. Like I'm like what yeah, word that's a great mention? word Toxified. yeah so I'm so we wonder then why you know our our society more and more is suffering from these really terrible issues like pre puberty way too soon and diseases and cancer and all this stuff there's definite links between all of that so we really just want to like we're worth more than that we're better than that nature provides right so that's what we're going to talk about. Did you want to say something? I like it. I love it. 
Um, when you were saying all that stuff, I, I was a professional organizer. Yes. And some of the houses that I would go into, and I have no judgment on anybody's life. It was an interesting, it was interesting to walk into people's lives and see what they did, yeah. you know, mentally. But walking in some of them, all I would want to do is bleach my hands when I left. Mm. And, and I can mentally think back to like, I saw mold in people's places mm. and I wanted like, I wished I was using thieves at this time. Mm. And I, and you know, like, but I just think yeah. of it like, it's just, you know better, you do better yes. type of deal. It's, yes. that's just what it is. It's yes. you know better, do better. 100%. So we're going to talk about, we're going to get everyone to know a little better today. <laughs> so how do that's you do how better? Talk, how do right? you, and better doesn't have to be hard. It's just going right. to be different. It's just going to be different. And th these products, the reason why they, they react differently um, is because they don't have the toxins in them exactly. that does the do the extra lathering yes. the stuff that we've been programmed or exposed to before so using them is gonna be a little bit different but they're gonna be so much better in the end a hundred percent so there's a little bit of that you know period of transition where it's like but wait it's not acting the same way but it is still cleaning and it it's is cleaning working better. it's cleaning better your yeah. house is gonna smell better you're gonna feel better all yes things. yes so what, should, she said. what should we start with um I think all things start. I was gonna say yes. I think you're right. We're gonna both hold ours. So I like. Um, I also like Echo uh, hacks. Yes. Recyclable hacks. Yes. Yeah, so we're gonna talk about. So Don Marie has some amazing hacks when it comes to uh, all of these products. How to make them Go last ahead. longer. How to use them in ways that are even more effective. All these ways. Okay. So we have these household cleaner. You guys, this is sort of the the basis for everything because you can make so many things out of this. This is a universal multi-purpose cleaner. We're talking your floors, every surface in your bathroom, every surface in your kitchen, even your windows. Furniture polish. Furniture polish, um, you know, adding it to different cleaners, which Domri will tell you about, um, to, to add a different element to the cleaning. Um, basically, you know, I use, this was a, actually one of the Essential Rewards give, giveaways uh, a couple years ago. You have it too. Yeah. So it's this beautiful bottle, right? And depending on how, you know, diluted. You the difference what exactly. We did. So mine's a little bit stronger, right? And she made hers this a little bit. This is just a, a regular all-purpose cleaner. Perfect. Is, yeah. Mine is like more for like greasy kitchen, stove, you know, that sort of thing. So it's a little more intense. But really you can use one part this to 30 parts water, which is like, I'll use like just a cap full, right? And then fill up this entire thing with water and then you're set. This thing lasts me like, I feel like at least six months. Yeah. At I least mean, six at months. least, depending yeah, on definitely. if I'm doing anything crazy, but yeah, so so that's amazing. Your house smells like thieves, which is divine, and you know, animals can be on the floor, and I'm not thinking about, oh, they're licking their food off the floor, and I'm worried about it. It's also, great. when you're like, especially when you clean yeah. the kitchen, sometimes you feel like if you did it with the old time house cold cleaners, you would want to wait a little bit because you like yes. thought this was going to go in your food, and oh, yes, yes, it was going in your food, but... Okay. Even just yesterday, I was talking to my husband, and I was cleaning stuff. I was cleaning the just the, the counter really, really quickly, and he was going to put, um, I think it was, uh, he was making some shrimp, and he was like, oh, man, you sprayed that around. I was like, it's all right, because it it's thieves. Right. It's I, fine. Exactly. It's yeah. fine. Exactly. It's so nice yeah. to know that. Yeah. Um, but this is 100% plant-based, you guys. So I'm just looking at the the ingredients and they're all 100% plant-based. The, the main ingredients are the Thieves Essential Oil. So you have those four or five, what is it, five oils? One, two, three, four, five. Clove, yeah. uh, eucalyptus radiata. Lemon. Cinnamon. Cinnamon. Bark. And rosemary. And rosemary. Yep, exactly. Those are the main ingredients. There's only like three other ingredients basically and they're uh, water and then a s sodium, a sulfur, sulfur, something that's basically a preservative, um, but plant-based and that's it. So yeah. you're talking like, basically you're washing with essential oils. So when you think of the Thieves household cleaner, just think of it as the foundation for all of your cleansers that you're going to be replacing. Exactly. So that's how you think of that and just as we're going through that, go back to going, okay, we're going to add yes. that to everything else. Perfect. All right. And so when you're thinking like, okay, my Lysol, my Windex, my... What else do people use? 409, all of those gone, household clean, Thieves Household Cleaner in. Comet, out, all my of comet, that, right? This is was what I made with my Check Comet. Check out that, yeah. So instead of Comet, this is a great DIY that's super easy. Baking and soda. And cheap. And cheap, and so much cheaper. Yeah. I hammered holes into a mason jar. Mm -hmm. You could get like the Parmesan cheese. Hi, Zach's gal. Sorry. Hey, Zach, how you doing? <laughs> 
Mm -hmm. You could get a Parmesan cheese kind of like a uh, shake or two, yep. anything. Yep. Um, and I like to keep some next to the sink into my near my kitchen and yeah. some in my bathroom. Yeah, yeah. I filled it up with baking soda. I put Citrus Fresh, which is also in the starter kit, yep. and Thieves. You let it, you shake it around, you let it sit. I like to sit, let it sit for a day so that all the essential oils kind of like mend with, uh, meld with all the baking soda. Yeah, yeah. And then you're done. Yep. You could also then put a little bit in like a, a ramekin yeah. and put some water in it and make like a soft scrub with it too. Yes. Like you replace soft scrub. So this is um, also what you can do is with the, so the, with, with the soft scrub, you could put this. Yeah with a little bit of this say, and make yeah. extra, like you, uh, like extra, like extra hard powerful, to cleaning. Yes. Yeah, hard to grout. Yeah. Just the stuff that gets nasty. 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 Nasty, because life yes. is nasty, it life is dirty. Sometimes. Life is dirty. But yeah, I love that one. Okay, good, so let's move on to, okay, let's do, I just love this. because I love this. This is so good. So this is one of our freebies this month in Essential Rewards, right? So this is a thieves hand soap. And I, you know, I was told this, uh, when I first um, joined Young Living, when when you have thieves hand soap in your bathroom, when people come over to your house, they and they go to the bathroom, they always come out and they're like, <laughs> like smelling their hands, yeah, because it smells so good. And so many people are like, what is that? Where did you get that soap? But it's basic. I mean, again, 100% plant based, um, really gentle. It's a foaming hand soap, so it does have the the foaming, you know, top. So it does have that foam that people like when they feel like, oh, my hands are, you know, I'm getting, they're getting really clean, but without the SLS, the sodium rural sulfate, which is really toxic. So this is a great thing to have in your bathroom. This also lasts, I feel like, forever. Sometimes I will also dilute it. I'll go, you know, when it gets to half, sorry, that was my dryer. When it gets to <laughs> half, I'm cleaning as we speak. <laughs> Um, it's a theme. <laughs> there is, it is. Um, I'll just fill the rest up with water because really it's that, it's completely um, power, powerful enough without, oh. yeah, without needing it to be full concentration. Nice. Yes. I like it. I like it. I like it. Yeah. Um, oh, one thing uh, yeah. I can mention, I forgot to mention this. Um, oh, yes. They're hot. With the, with the Thieves Household Cleaner bottle, yeah. you could just save them. Mm -hmm. And this is just a normal spray bottle. And... This is actually, I like to use this in the bathroom because I don't want to have a glass bottle in the bathroom. Yeah. And so that's what I do with that if you guys were wondering so what So you get was. your new one and then you keep the old one and just fill it up like a little bit and then the rest with water. You put a cap of that in yep. the empty bottle of yep. this and fill it up with water and you got a basic yes. cleanser or you yes. do all the other, you know. Different concentrations. Yes. Perfect. Done, sorry. So then the dish soap. Let's talk about dish, dish soap. This is huge for me. Huge. This was huge for me. So do you, well, first I'm going to tell them about, okay, first okay. of all, dish soap. Let's talk about washing your dishes and how. Go ahead. Well, this you is go. your story. No, you no, you but. Uh, I will basically, the thing I want to say is people think like, oh, I'm going to get my dishes really clean with this soap that's what, um, let me think of one, palm olive or, you know, any, whatever, yours, done. Um, and, you know, we wash the dishes, we wash the pots and pans or whatever. With so many chemicals, by the way. Yeah. And then we cook on that. We put water on it, warm it up. Right. Anytime you're warming up something that has chemicals in it that and water, the water is absorbing all of those chemicals, and then that goes into your food, whatever you're cooking or whatever you're drinking, right? And we don't really think about that. But a lot of these these you know commercial soaps that are full of chemicals, you guys, you know how they leave, they leave that like no drops sheen on your dishes. That is chemicals that they're leaving on your dishes. So then we cook with it and we wonder why we're sick. <laughs> you were ingesting all of those chemicals. I hate to, to be the one to tell you, but that's what's happening. So what you wash yeah. your dishes with, you guys, is Matter. so important. Yeah. It's so, like, that's what you're eating, let yeah. alone walking on the floors, right, with, with the other chemicals. So tell us your story because I love your story. I like, uh, okay. It was so, a tough transition for you. Oh, it was a tough, okay, so all this stuff, I always, I, I call up, I'm like, I'm having multiple divorces <laughs> happening with all these products I use. Yeah. It's like I'm having a divorce, and I'm like, it was an emotional moment, because when I was younger, my name is Dawn Marie, half of my name is Dawn, my, my family, all of my whole family used Dawn because it's of half you. of my name, yeah. and uh, and then they have that intoxicating story that it helps animals and it takes grease out of them. And so you feel really, really good, which is really kind of like you go, okay, that's an advertising ploy. 
Yes. This was hard for me talking about lather because when I first used the Thieves, I didn't understand. I was like, it's not lathering. Mm -hmm. So it's not cleaning. So then I, I did research and what you could do is add baking soda to it and it does lather up. But I was like, this, this is not, it feels like it's not cleaning, although I know that it is, yeah. but it's not. Yeah, I was yeah. like, this, and my husband was like, honey, this sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Where are the bubbles? Yes, yes. And anybody who would come over was trying to do something yeah. nice by cleaning our, they would be yeah, yeah. also yeah. commenting. Yeah. And now I know what the difference is. And now I know that this is a, a better choice. Yeah. But, and it took some time for me to realize how to make it, to make it, it does lather. It's never gonna lather like the toxic one and that's gonna, that's, that's actually good. Mm -hmm. So I've embraced mm -hmm. that finally. Yeah. That's the sign that I've made the right switch. Absolutely. That it's not lathering like the toxic blue stuff that yeah. we were using before. Yeah. So there's this, and then there's the, um, the dishwasher uh, powder yeah. that I also love yeah. now. Um, instead of all the drops, it doesn't take off all the drops in your dishwasher, but it also doesn't leave the toxins on my on our dishes too. Yeah. yeah. And what I like to do is, it's so powerful when you get it. It's in this bag. Mm -hmm. I use one scoop of this to two scoops of baking soda, and I that. leave it in a mason jar, and I use one scoop for a big load. And then what I like to do is put a squeeze of this oh. in the first uh, uh, compartment that most dishwashers have yeah, yeah. for the pre-wash. Yeah, yeah. And then I'm done. Well. Wow. Yeah. Because you feel like you feel like this is concentrated enough to where you add that baking soda. I found that it is. Yeah, that's yeah. amazing. I yeah, found that it is. So yeah. yeah, you don't need a lot of it. And, and trial and error has taught me that. It's yes. <laughs> As it, does. As it does. I found it from personal experience yes. that you don't need that much of it. You just put one scoop to two scoops. Um, I think yeah. you want to hit me. Oh, oops, sorry guys. Um, Thank you. We're going to look pretty good. And, uh, and then that's it. So yeah. And, and it was, it's one of those things. We use it with everything. Yeah. And yeah. if you're removing this, you're removing a huge toxin. Oh, huge. Out of your household. Yes. And I was, you brought up two really great things, which are our emotional attachment to certain products that we've been using our whole lives, right? And that idea that like, oh, but that's my bleach, that's my whatever. I'm used to that, I'm used to that label, I'm used to that smell, that means clean to me, right? We have to recognize that like, you know, it is, it's not always easy to transition and it does take, sometimes it does take a little bit of time. You know, I was more of the like, ditch and switch everything all at once because I, but that was like a necessity due to my health at the time. But, um, you know, it's also okay to like slowly go, slowly do this, like one product at a time and adjust each product. Um, and also, you know, another thing that we're programmed to buy into is this idea that soap suds mean clean. That is 100% made up. It's, ma it's made up. It's an advertising it's an ploy. Advertising just, like, ploy. just like bubble bath on the baby's head and how cute that is. Bubbles? Just like Dawn is taking grease off of ducks in like Antarctica uh -huh. or whatever. 100%. Like it's so this idea that suds equal clean is actually not true. And you and you know bef this if you look back even what a hundred years that was there were no suds that wasn't a thing right soap was like actually lard it was like made from animal fat and it was didn't sud Isn't at it all. Isn't lie too like lie like lie yeah. yeah. So so it's it's also something we have to kind of you know adjust to. Um, I have found that this the dish soap for me has been I think feel like my dishes because I because we hand wash everything we don't have a dishwasher um, I feel like my dishes are so much shinier than what I would from what I was used to using like this this I feel leaves I mean I feel like it leaves things so incredibly clean which I love personally I yeah just, I and, and I was so used to doing that squeak creak creak oh, afterwards yeah. and I was like oh God, this it was but so emotional to me. I understand. And then for me, what I I mean, and for again for it. using my hack, I keep after you buy after you buy uh, when you replace it. I like to keep these because these are actually yeah. safe for essential oils. The plastic doesn't get eaten yeah. by the by the essential oils that you put will place in them. I could also put extra citrus yeah. brush in here or yeah. thieves essential oil on top of it. Yeah. I, I, what I do is I split one of these bottles in thirds, hmm. and you can make three bottles. Oh so, wow! Yeah, because yeah. this is also very concentrated. It's very concentrated, yeah. and then I fill it up with a teaspoon of baking soda for that suds. For that suds, yeah. and then every time I just shake it and one thing, and then it, I get so many dishes done, and they're so clean because some of the yeah. stuff you have to hand wash, and some you can put in That's a dishwasher. True. Exactly, exactly. So, all right, good. So, so got fun. Packs so going. weird. So weird. All it? right, so let's talk about the fruit. The fruit. The fruit. The fruit. She wash. said the fruit like Julia so, Child. <laughs> you just. <laughs> 
a luxurious child. So this is actually a, a very, very, very concentrated little jug of fruit and veggie soak. Um, we both have one. <laughs> so this is actually also part of your Young Living Essential Rewards um, promos this, this month. month. Yeah. So this was free for me and I'm sure for you. Yep. And the awesome thing, you know, Domri and I were talking about this at the beginning. We always thought like fruit washes were like BS. Like I'll say well, it, this bullshit. is just a freaking what? Who needs who needs this? This is a marketing wash, ploy. Fruit. Just use you your water wash the water. Use a brush. You're totally. fine. However, <laughs> yeah. That's it's not the case. Uh, okay, so I started using this, I don't know, I guess probably maybe a year ago. And I'll just like take my fruit and vegetables like in a bowl and fill it with water and then put like, I don't know, for this, gosh, not very much. I mean like not even not even a capful probably yeah. of this in, in the bowl, not even. And just let it soak. That's all you have to do is you let it sit. You know, you, maybe you can brush, brush it off a little for a couple minutes, right? And then you come back and... All of a sudden, the it's water crazy. is yellow. It's crazy. <laughs> or has floating things in it. And you can see the real color of your fruit and vegetables, like the real greens of your broccoli versus the waxy, whatever was on top, pesticides, whatever. Um, and then you just rinse off your fruits and vegetables from there, and you're good. And it's like, it's incredible. You know, even, I've heard that even your organic produce, you know, has some sort of wax or some sort of, um, well, also with the organic ones, also yeah. you're going to have a lot more dirt in different places and it's got bugs. other things, bugs, yeah, exactly. because the pesticides haven't killed the bugs. Exactly, which, fine, we're okay. We're yeah, okay yeah, yeah. But yeah, so it's actually really, really incredible. And this jug, la I mean, I can't imagine how long it's to last because I've only had that teeny tiny bottle. Oh, wow. And I've had it for like six months. Wow. So this is going to last a long time. I just started just using so you know. this and yeah. I will tell you that I was one of those people like, this is, this is unnecessary. This is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah, do yeah. I really need this? Yeah. And when I do my celery juice every morning, that's oh, how I yeah. could really tell the difference. When I clean my salads, I saw a, I saw a huge difference, but I started with my celery. Yeah. And oh my God. I thought yeah. I was cleaning them like because there's grooves in it yeah. anyway. You have yeah. to clean celery really, really yeah. well. After after the first time and I lift the celery out and wash it, I was like looking, like you said, there's like this waxy kind yeah. of filmy strangeness that's in there that I was like, what the hell else was I cleaning? I thought that I was, I thought I was eating clean yeah. fruit. I felt yeah. bad for anybody who ate fruit in my house oh, or vegetables. I was like, oopsies, well, no better, do better. There's one thing I wanted to say about this as far as the ingredients go. So this one also is full of oils, right? It has the thieves in it, but it also has ginger, peppermint, uh, lemongrass, fennel, clove, rosemary, lemon, this is all, uh, citronella, um, tea tree oil, um, myrtle, lavender, patchouli. Um, so what, so basically this is all essential oils, honestly, except for the glycerin, there's water and glycerin in it and some citric acid. So basically, um, the essential oils are cutting through all of that stuff, right? So, you know, essential oils we have to remember are the, the lifeblood of the plant are the part of the plant that was protecting it um, and keeping invaders out. So when we use that to clean our veggies, we're getting um, all that the yucky stuff off the, the plants and, and fruits and vegetables, but we're also um, getting to, if there's any residue from the cleaner, we're getting the greatness of the essential oils in our yeah. bodies, which is awesome. Because ginger is really great for your digestion, so oh, is fennel, yeah. so is, yeah, so many things. in there. Yeah. Okay, great. So <sighs> we only have like what, well, one, one or two more? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, so we could do yes. laundry. So this yes. wasn't that hard for me. Like mm -hmm. this, I was, I, I thought I was using, the my story with, with the laundry detergent is I thought I was using a clean mm. uh, laundry soap because it said it was clean. Yeah, And yeah. that's called greenwashing. Yes, it um, is. And Keep talking, I'm just gonna put a charger on it. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Um, and so I was basically uh, bamboozled, <laughs> like many people. Um, and I'm not going to mention the name of the one, but everybody uses it. And so when I got oh, this, yeah. I was like, well, let me see how this works. Again, my hack is that this is so concentrated. Yeah. You, I, I split the bottles in half. Mm -hmm. when, you, when I replace it, I split the bottle in half. You could also put half of it in a mason jar and then uh, fill the rest up with water. And I like to put a capful of the foundation of all the thieves 
the household cleaner in it because I feel like it gets stains out. You can make a stain remover. You could uh, remove all that uh, that toxic stain removers that they're they're putting on the market too with just the household cleaner. I swear to you, it works so well. Mm -hmm. So that I like to put a cap of this in here, half of it, so you're actually getting two bottles for the price of one, and you do about 64 loads with. Oh, hi guys. Sorry about that. My bad. <laughs> are you there? Nothing's happening. Where are you going? <laughs> You're imagining things. My God. What's happening? <laughs> are you there? Are you there? Do you want me to move it? No, I'm good. Okay, I'm good. Keep that was so funny. You are so funny. You have to see how she's working to get oh, this yeah. all done. Like, this know. is so hilarious. So what I wanted to just say is this is uh, the laundry soap has, I'll read what's inside of here. Um... Eucalyptus radiata, rosemary, cinnamon bark, mm -hmm. clove, mm -hmm. lemon peel, citrus lemon, bergamot. That's what makes it smell so good. You can hear my voice. Hi, guys. Wait, Sorry about this. What are you doing? I'm just turning it over. I'm turning it around. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Oh, hi. 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 I'm going to have to move this. Sorry. My bad. Hi. This is how we're doing. We don't, have, we don't need the light. We're hey, good. Can I see you? Yeah. Okay, sorry, I turned it over. This is just not close enough. Okay, now I think I can. Do okay. I? Can you see you? Yes, I can see me, okay. but it's a little. Wait. Ah. Uh, uh, wait. Now it's a little. A little wonky. Yeah. There we go. Sorry, guys. My bad. My battery was about to die, so I don't want that to happen. All right, oh, so, that's what was happening. Yeah, I was like, I'm not, I'm not understanding. I shouldn't want it to all of a sudden stop. Um. Yeah. So the thieves. The, the, the thing I want to say about this, too, is this looks like a really small bottle. I remember being like, oh, wait, it's so tiny. You don't need a lot. Oh, my gosh. So all you need to fill is this bottom half. You don't even have to fill it up to here for, like, H, uh, yep. H-E, like the high, high energy ones. Yep. It's, like, up to there. Yeah. So this is, like, at minimum 64 loads. But if you're doing it, like, less, then, like, yeah, it, it, this, this at least goes, I mean, I feel like we keep this for a six, for three months or something yeah, like that. Yeah, at least three months for us. Because we're talking, you know, really, really concentrated on this one. Well, and with mine, for yeah. one of these, it's yeah. it's six months because it's three months with, it. mine is diluted. Oh, right. Because I yeah. do, yeah. So depending on the... Your, with that, with that, you do the household cleaner, right? Yeah, yeah, I mix mine with yeah. the household cleaner yeah. in it too and the water and everything. Oh, so good. And then when you got the, the laundry thing, yep. what you can also do is one of the most toxic things that is in our laundry room are dryer sheets. Yes, oh, yes. <sighs> okay, one of the worst <laughs> things that one of the worst things that I found out is that they it, they're lined with animal fat. Yeah. So when they're going in your clothes, know that you have animal fat. A nice on your coating clothes. of animal nice. fat. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Delish. Fantastic. I know. Terrible. Mm -hmm. And and a lot of other things. A lot of other things. You know, I have a one of my cousins always used to get rashes when she would sleep on her sheets, and she didn't know oh. why. And it took forever for them to realize that she was allergic to. It was like Snuggies, like the little bear. They smell the, so good. They smell so good, but it's so toxic for our skin, right? And at night, when we're all bundled up in our sheets, some of us get sweaty, and your pores yeah. are open, and then you, you're you taking all of that nastiness. Well, I have eczema. Oh, yes. And the place where it shows up for me is on my back. Yeah. And I noticed once I made the switch from this, mm -hmm. my eczema, I haven't had a flare-up. That's amazing. So it's exactly that when you're sleeping. That's the your first. Uh, you don't really think about when you're sleeping. You're actually inhaling. Your body's like the pores are soaking yes. up everything. And also on those sheets would also be whatever is in your dryer sheet. Mm -hmm. And this is another thing about learning how to do something differently. Yes. These great. will last longer. I've had these for over a year and a half. Yep. That talk about like this was a. Uh, a bag of six was eight bucks. Yep. I don't know how much, but I know I'm saving tons of money every month tons on the snuggles. Yep. Um, you toss them in. What I like to do is put a couple in uh, in the dry room right before it's about to end. I will put a couple of uh, with the essential oils on here. Yeah. Let it dress. sit. Yeah. And right before the cycle is ending, I'll then toss it in. Yeah. And you get that right. nice uh, bright Ooh. smell. Yes. Because you were saying oh, that yeah. this oil would be good too, which I yeah. never smelled before. Yeah, Kunzia. Yeah. So we, yeah. so I use, we, I always use, I use uh, dryer balls as well. And Young Living does have them. I'm not sure if they have them all the time or if it's just they're a available right they now. Do. I saw. Yeah, I think they are. Yeah. So that's something you can always add to your essential awards order, and then just put on, you know, whatever smell you you love. Really, I try to 
use something citrusy because I find that that really cuts through really like you really smell it afterwards um, or what in your clothing lemongrass I find is, is one of the most the one one of the ones that works the best um, yeah so that's an incredible and easy way to um, ditch and switch ditch and, and save switch. I mean save. for the money if you wanted yeah. to do the math I haven't but I was buying like a box of snuggles for like yeah. every month and a half or so yeah and I haven't purchased any more of these yeah. in a year and a half That's so amazing. and for static you just want to put a safety pin for the DIY hack oh. you attach a safety pin in it and on a that. couple of them and it removes the static uh, yeah that's so cool or you could end with some it. of them you put water and make them a little bit damp oh, yeah. so you put a couple of them a little damp a couple of them with a safety pin closed up on it exposed yeah yeah and it takes away the static that is so fascinating yeah. amazing well, you know so I try yeah <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so this month, you guys, we can talk about what's available this month with, with through your essential rewards um, order. This month is a lot of things. It's so it's good. Amazing. I always love March because Young Living, their their essential rewards promos are always like very spring clean and full of you know thieves and whatnot. So this month, when you order your hundred PV essential rewards order through Young Living, you get a five mil of orange essential or, or orange vitality. Orange vitality. And, and, and Vitality Oil, you can ingest it. You can also use it, like, on your dryer balls or, I you like know. to use it on my teeth for a little bit extra whitening. Yes. It's a natural uh, teeth whitener. Totally works. Yeah. Um, and it's not toxic because teeth whiteners are, are really toxic. toxic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that's a great one. Then when you get your 190 PV order, we add on, I believe, the, the hand soap? Or is it the dish, dish, dish soap? soap. Yes. Dish soap. We add the dish soap and the thieves? Yes. Yes. So we have, so you get these three for your 190 PV order, right? And I believe they're both five mil. And the Thieves Essential Oil, of course, you can always add a little bit more of it to any of the Thieves products, your cleaning products, if you want to in increase the smell. I clean then, my floors with that one. Actually, I'm going to have you hold them yeah, also, I, you just have to keep adding. Uh, yes. And I like to oh, clean yeah. my floors with this one, too. Oh. I put a little bit of this, a, a little bit of that. I put a little bit of this and, and a little bit, bit of that, this um, and that with the household cleaner. I love I that. Put a so that's the last. So this is the yeah. Okay. This is. So the, this is the this is one ninety. Okay. Then we get to two fifty, which I believe yeah. Both of these at two fifty, right? So you get your lifetime supply of fruit and veggie soap, and your hand soap. Yeah. So that's your two hundred fifty PV order. Then last but not least, we add these. You all know. <laughs> so this is a big. These are all free this month, you guys. So you have your thieves household cleaner that's gonna last you probably at least six months. You have your Kunzia oil, which I didn't talk about yet. Kunzia oil is Young Living's newest oil. It got added last year or last summer. It's from Australia. It's like tea tree. It's very cleansing. Um, they noticed that the plant that was growing near the barbed wire fences uh, out in the wild was not rusting where this plant was growing. And so basically it's very... Um, it's very, anti it's a very strong antioxidant oil. It's extremely um, good for cleaning as well. And what, how would you describe the smell? It's really hard to. It's hard to describe. It, it, sorry, I'm just gonna. You know, no, it's alright. I got it. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll, I'll be. It's like. It smells. It's clean and like. Very kind of, very clean. Uh huh. And like woodsy, like, like, woodsy, like, I would say woodsy, woodsy earthy, earthy. It's definitely more earthy. Um, Woodsy, earthy, clean, like you walked through a wet pine forest. Ooh, I like that. Yeah, because it's not quite like bright piney. It's more it's like, like an earthy. It's like wet, earthy, kind of like it was just a rainstorm. Yeah. And like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. That smells amazing. Ooh, yeah. So it's really lovely. So all of this for free when you order a 300 PV order. What? And ooh, and basically, look at you holding I got it. I got it. <laughs> so basically what Essential Rewards is, for those of you guys, you guys who don't know, is really the best thing ever. It's um, your monthly wellness box. It comes to your door. It's how Don Marie and I, and, I, and lots of people, um, supply our toxin-free life. So you don't have to go to Target and run errands and get all this, try to get all of your non-toxic products from all these different places. You get them all in one place, delivered to your door, and in addition, because you're this ordering is, this, this is way, the, the beauty of it. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> your your first three months, you um, get 10% back on every single order. So that starts to add up, right? After three months, your fourth month through the 24th month, you get 20% back on every order. And then after that, you get 25% back. And the points add up. The points add up fast, right? And so that's dollars. Yeah. You're making money while you're spending money. Exactly. So for me, I got, you know... <laughs> Not only did I, you know, I spent 300 PV to get, to, to get all my household needs met, my body things met, my bathroom things, you know, needs met. Then I got all of this for free, right? And I got $75 back just to spend on whatever I want, right? So that's my points back and my free products. So that's what's so amazing about Essential Rewards. And also what I noticed, okay, I'm going to yeah, put some of these down. Yeah. <laughs> that was, that was, <laughs> I was like, it's very effective. Okay. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I call. <laughs> Okay, so what I noticed too is you don't have to feel like you have to get the 300 PV. Yeah, yeah. Um, you could start off small. Some yeah. months are different than others, just like you would go out to shop some months to yeah. Target and some months not. But while I was shopping and I watched your uh, your video for the animals oh, uh, yeah. and uh, to replace the flea, uh, yeah. flea medication that I was using yeah. on my little Effie, yeah. little Cavalier King Charles. Oh. I know. But I added it and I hit another PV where I then was like, oh, I was ordering more thieves. I don't have to order thieves anymore. I can remove that. Oh, I was ordering more orange. It's actually coming free this month. Mm -hmm. And and you start to look at the promos to see when you're going to be shopping or stuff like that. You find them out every month. Exactly. Um, so you could actually then shop accordingly. Yes. So you can plan like, oh, okay, they're going to give me this stuff for free, so I don't need to order that myself. I'm going to order try something else, or I'm going to, you know, supply my shampoo and conditioner and whatever. Yeah. And, and the cleaning products are just gonna come. We so, yeah. have shampoos, we have pers all oh personal gosh. cares, we have underarm deodorant, we, I mean, there's so many things. Everything you can imagine, I mean, all the yeah. supplements you could need, all the, obviously, essential oils, but then everything is essential oil infused, premium products at incredible prices, everything's very, all the products are very concentrated, so they last a really long time. Yeah. And it's just wonderful to know that, like, I don't have to worry. Like, I know Young Living standards, and they're insanely high, and, um, thank you, baggage. Um, they're insanely high and I don't have to worry about like, oh gosh, what is in this? Is, this, or is, it, is Are they just greenwashing this package that I'm seeing at Target right now? How do I know where this really came from? And I just know that it's the best stuff for my animals, for me, for my- And you could also, because we all feel like we're doing better, I felt like I was doing better with the laundry soap that I was using. And uh, it's seventh generation, and oh, I thought yeah. it was. And, yeah. and they're, they're. You assume these are like, yeah. It's like method. Miss like, Myers. Everyone and, assume, or Myers. Everyone Myers. Assumes. Everybody thinks that it's. When I've mentioned that to other people, they're like, no, I'm like, yeah, scratch the surface on the pro, uh, on the ingredients in the back. It takes an extra step, but that's why it's so great because you just know that uh, with Young Living, yeah. all that work has already been done for you. Totally. And so anything that you get, you can actually go, I know that whatever I have, this is going to be way better. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. And the last thing I'll say, something you guys can do if, if you're still not convinced, is there is an app you can get on your phone. It's, it's the EWG, the Environmental Working Group. I think it's just called EWG app. But you can scan any barcode of pretty much any product, household, cosmetic, self-care, and it'll give you a great a rating of how toxic it is, and and you can see for yourself, <laughs> you know what needs to go, like what and needs to be the, Also, it's the layering of all these these chemical laden stuff that is what is actually showing up. Yeah. Like now they're realizing that baby powder. Oh my gosh, the baby, baby oil, baby powder, baby oil, baby powder. Johnson and Johnson's baby shampoo is one of the worst things. It's, it rates a ten, which is the worst it can rate, by the way, yeah. on EWG. Yeah. So it's just know we better, just, do exactly. do better. That's I mean, yeah. Don't kick yourself, but know that there is there is an option for you. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So if you guys have any questions, please post in the comments. We will get back to them. We'll check on those and get back to you. Yes. Um, and yeah, I think that's it. You guys have an amazing Monday. spring clean. Spring cleaning. Just, yeah, enjoy. Get rid of the old, make room for the new. Yeah, try at least one new thing this month. What can I try out, out of these Steve's products, you know, and, and make room for, for yeah. toxin free? Oh, I like that. I like yeah. that. Choose one thing because it's, so. it's, it's yeah. just, just choose one thing that whatever resonated that you're like, huh? Yes. Trust your gut and go, let me try swapping that one out. Yes. And then let us know yes. what you think. All right, love you all. Mwah. Thanks for being with us. Bye. Bye. So now.